Hi Pisces, how are you? I hope you're doing well and getting ready for New Year's. Um, this is my astrological tarot reading for the sign of Pisces for the month of January 2022. By the way, I am Sandy Couture. Thank you for watching. Um, it's going to be a, a nice month coming up. I mean, there are some some challenges, but only in that it's asking the the this, the planets are asking you to review things and and not to jump forward in a quick method. Make sure you have all the information, examine what you desire and what really you value. And um, the planets that are doing that is uh, Venus, which is all about love, money, relationships. Um, what you deeply value in life and it is currently retrograde in the in the sign of capricorn so um it really is asking you to take a review of the things you value and what's happening in your life on a personal level if somebody um was getting a reading i might ask them how their relationships were because it is definitely a time to review relationship issues and relationship um, situations. Mercury, the planet of thinking and thought and communication, is also going to be going retrograde mid-month in January, about the 14th. So once again, uh, the universe is asking you to slow down, make sure you have all the information at hand for whatever it is you're moving forward with before you step out onto the ice, so to speak. But the one most wonderful thing for you, Pisces, is that Jupiter, the planet of expansion and abundance, is moving into, actually it is at zero degrees Pisces right now, and it will be in the sign of Pisces mostly, unless it goes retrograde, for the next two years. It takes about, oh no, it takes about one year for Jupiter to transit a sign. During this time, uh, you may have heightened intuition, heightened information coming to you uh, from the other layers of what what is the known universe, um, anything to do with dreams and desires and moving forward and soul growth is going to be very positively aspected for you. So I'm excited for you. The first card that I pulled for you, Pisces, is the Three of Cups. Cups is about water, emotions. Three is a balance number, trilogy, you know, body, mind, spirit, father, son, holy ghost. It's a completion number. Uh, these girls are celebrating. So it looks as though Pisces, this beginning of this um, astrological forecast for you and or tarot reading is all about celebrating and being grateful for where you are and what you have. Um, once again, the um, surprise or challenge card is a three. So another completion number for you, which is kind of impressive to have those pulled randomly. Um, I think that means you're in a really good place. This card is about being a master of what you're doing. So um, don't, don't underestimate everything that you bring to the table in any situation. The process card, how you make your way through the month, is the page of wands. Now, wands is a fire card, and wands are about action. Pages are about gathering information. So this month, once again, going in with the retrograde things, is to really do some um, information gathering before you move forward in any direction. Um, but you will be asked to take action. Whether it's gathering the information or moving forward, there will be some action steps involved. And the most likely outcome card is you will reach the end of the month in a completely balanced state, male and female. I love this card, it's so pretty. I mean, it could mean that you will have a new relationship. If this were a private reading, it could be about a beautiful new relationship coming into your life. But for a general reading, it feels as though things will start to fall into place as long as you keep yourself balanced. So hopefully that was helpful for all you Pisceans out there. Have a wonderful, wonderful January and Happy New Year. Thank you so much for watching. If you have any questions you'd like to um, forward to me, please drop me a line and I will be more than happy to answer them. Have a great month. Bye now.